How's it going, everyone? It's Harvey from Web and Sponge. That was it today. It is January 6, 2022, approaching January 7, 2022. And look at outside. We are seeing just a very heavy snowfall here in northern New Jersey. We're starting to see a little bit of snowfall accumulation. It isn't a lot. It's still less than half an inch, probably even less than a quarter of an inch. But we're seeing a pretty heavy clip of snowfall move through the northern new jersey area as where it's beginning to see the snow starting to accumulate right on the roads and this is only just the beginning it's only around 10 30 um, p.m right now eastern standard time and we're gonna see the snow continue here till around 9 a.m today so um into tomorrow i meant to say but we're, yeah you guys could probably see we're seeing a heavy amount of snow right now the temperature is right around 30 right now so it's cold enough to support so far and this heavy snow should continue throughout the overnight hours for us to receive around three to six inches of snow before it's all said and done here in northern new jersey so right now it seems like we're gonna we're gonna get out of the snow just a, for a little bit uh, within i'd say the next hour but we should return back into the heavy snow and we should be covered in a uh, completely different um different snowfall accumulation total by the end of a morning tomorrow so this is definitely something we're going to need to keep in mind over the next couple hours right now the roads are pretty quiet it seems like the people here have heeded the warnings to stay off the roads and while there isn't a ton of snow on the roads just yet um i haven't seen a lot of plows just yet but I expect to see them more as nighttime progresses so um he, so there's my report for right now in north new jersey i'll make sure to do another report later during the night as we begin to see more snowfall accumulation here throughout northern new jersey So I'm reporting here in northern New Jersey for this major snowstorm. It's around 2.30 a.m. in the morning and we're seeing snowfall rates equivalent to one inch per hour right now as this is some of the heaviest snow I've seen in quite a long time. As I measured the snow on the ground, we're around two inches and we still have another three to six inches of snow left to go before this storm is all said and done. So it seems like this snowstorm has exceeded expectations here in Northern New Jersey. And we're of course seeing all the roads cover partially because uh, a lot of the um, a lot of cars haven't passed by the roads but we're seeing the snowfall rates so heavy to a point where the snow plows can't even keep up we're seeing the snow continue to accumulate over the shoveled roadways just at a very rapid pace and the road conditions are dangerous stay indoors for the overnight hours because you, the roads will 
continue to stay dangerous as long as these rapid snowfall rates continue and it's expected to continue where we're going to experience one inch per hour snowfall rates over the next couple hours so expect just heavy snowfall in the overnight hours i've been checking the radar and it doesn't seem like the heavy snow is going to end anytime soon so the best bet is to just stay indoors throughout northern new jersey but take a look outside in terms of how the conditions are like it's quite beautiful to be honest to see this much snow all over the trees all over the grass it looks it looks like very beautiful to see to be honest and i'm glad to experience a snowstorm like this it's around 30 degrees it's not too cold so the snow is definitely the more um wet slushy type of snow that's that will easily stick off the trees and i definitely like prefer that kind of snow at least when it comes to the scenery because it adds on because it sticks onto trees and that makes it just all the more beautiful right here in northern new jersey but it's going to be difficult to shovel that snow in the morning so make sure to watch out for that and the snow should end around 9 a.m but overall guys the road conditions are very bad here in northern new jersey but it's just a very beautiful sight to see just this much snow here in new jersey but make sure to got, stay safe guys make sure to take precaution on the roadways because it's going to be very dangerous for tonight and even um for the early morning during your rush hour as you might want to make second plans of potentially going out um this or at least i'm um, going to work or school during rush hour because it's going to be just quite dangerous to roads and it should continue until the mor friday morning january 7th that's when the low pressure should move to the northeast and not affect new jersey any longer which is definitely good news the slow pressure is moving quite fast but we're still gonna see heavy snowfall rates as this snow hasn't stopped over the past two hours i'd say and it's just gonna only gonna continue which uh, is amazing how this powerful this storm is despite um moving so fast but anyways guys i thank you guys for watching and um i hope you guys stay safe How's it going everyone? It's Harvey from Weather Sponge by Thousand Day. It's January 7, 2022, and I'm reporting live here in northern New Jersey during this major social where right now we're experiencing snowfall rates around one inch per hour. So far, we already received around two, three inches of snow here in northern New Jersey, and we still have another two to four inches of snow left to go here and which seems like this snowstorm is going to exceed expectations here in northern new jersey as we're just going to see heavy snowfall rates up until i'd say right around 9 a.m here in new jersey before the storm is all said and done but looking around uh, based on the um environment it looks quite beautiful i'd say just seeing all the snow stick on the trees as well as the grass it's been quite a long time since i've seen a real snowstorm here in new jersey so it's definitely uh, well um welcome to see it once again as i'm glad to experience a snowstorm but it's certainly not very good conditions on the roads as right now the, the snow clouds can't seem to keep up when it comes to the, the amount of snow with the snowfall rates as it seems like every time the snow plows pass by these roads the snow seems to eventually cov um, cover the roads once again at a very fast rate and of course that is as a direct result of the high snowfall rates we're seeing in new jersey but it is quite beautiful just to look around the environment with this snowstorm but again make sure to take precaution on roads because it's going to be very dangerous and in terms of the timing this should end i'd say right around 9 a.m this morning as that's when the low pressure should move to the northeast at a very fast rate so that certainly should put a limit to the snowfall here in northern new jersey but this is still a very major snowstorm you need to take seriously in northern new jersey so in the overnight hours make sure to take precaution and don't go out unless it's an extreme emergency and make sure to get those shovels get the salt ready for your driveways because especially with slushy snow like this it's around 30 degrees so the snow is very moist you're gonna need uh you're gonna need to shovel a lot this morning which might be a bummer for some people but it is at the same time it is quite beautiful to see the snow in the environment so i guess it evens itself out but make sure to stay take precaution here 
it throughout the northeast as this should be a major snowstorm especially on the extreme eastern portions of the northeast such as boston and massachusetts that's where it could be even worse for you guys because you're definitely going to be closer to the heavier snow bands associated with the low pressure system so make sure to stay um, safe all throughout the northeast and i hope you guys have a good night and a uh, good day whenever you're watching this How's it going everyone? It's Tommy from Weather Spongebob. That was the day. It's January 7, 2022, the morning after this snowstorm. And as you can see, we have a lot of snow here in northern New Jersey. We received around 5 inches of snow, which was right around forecasted, which um, is between that 3 to 6 inch forecast we were expecting. And we received right around that amount. So this forecast was rather accurate. And in terms of how it looks, um, it looks quite beautiful to be honest, seeing all the snow stick onto the trees, the roofs. It's a quite nice scenery um, to be honest with you. And um, it's this snow is that um, wet type snow, so it much it, it sticks onto surfaces much easier than let's say dry type snow. So it definitely looks more beautiful as a result. It seems like most of the roads have been cleared out, which is certainly good news. Um, the driving should be safe. For today which is certainly good news so for people who um who might need to go out this morning for rush hour then the road should be completely fine which is certainly good news to make for a safe travel but um yeah guys it looks quite beautiful in terms of the temperature of the day it should be right around 35 so we should see some of the snow begin to melt but we're gonna see temperatures hover around the freezing over the next several days so it might take a while before the snow completely melts and who knows by the time it might be approaching uh, the, its melting phase where the snow completely melts we could experience maybe our next snowstorm there isn't any snowstorm expected in the foreseeable future here but there might be that possibility that if the melting process is slow over the next couple of days we might have another snowstorm that will add on top of this snow we already experienced but yeah guys it looks quite beautiful this snow is very wet it's easy to stick make snowballs with them essentially make a snowman so i'm sure the kids will enjoy that and i'm sure a lot of kids will be sledding as well today this is enough snow to go out sledding so um it's definitely a great day to do it but um yeah guys i hope you guys stay safe and i thank you all for watching